Welcome to WWAP TV. If you enjoy the content, hit the like button, subscribe button, and notification bell. What? What? Look. Look, y'all, look. Look, you wipe it off and nothing happens. Like, this is the life that I'm living at this point. Like, this is the life that I guess I'm gonna have to live. <laughs> so, yeah. I feel absolutely awful for this person. She made the decision to use Gorilla Glue spray in her hair instead of hairspray because she was out thinking maybe it would last just a little bit longer and she'd still be able to wash it out. But Gorilla Glue spray is incredibly durable and doesn't wash out easily. So what would you do according to a dermatologist? The first thing that you can do is use acetone. Acetone can help to break the bonds of the glue. Acetone is safe to put on the skin. It can be irritating, it can be drying, but trying to break down those bonds. I would go to a professional hair salon and let them help you apply the acetone and work it through the hair. You probably still wanna see a dermatologist just in case you're getting any irritation on the scalp after all of these treatments. There's another product called Goo Gone. That one is not necessarily safe to use on the skin, but if the acetone doesn't work sufficiently, I would go ahead and give that a try try to keep it in the hair only and then see a dermatologist to take care of any irritation on the scalp.